Hello everyone, I'm back with another art tutorial and today we'll be painting some rain. I mixed some white and light blue to make a pastel kind of blue. Next to this pastel blue, I'm using grey which I made by mixing white and black. Then I cleaned my brush and made it a little wet with which I wet the blue area and with the same brush slightly blending the edges of the two colors. I'm taking some of the gray area inside the blue area. Then I took my thick flat dry brush and I'm smudging over the whole blue area which resulted in a smooth blend of the grey and blue areas. I took the same shade of grey and I'm patting it with the brush on the surface. I mixed a little amount of black to the previous shade and I'm patting with it on the surface once again. Brush over it using a dry brush to create a texture. I mixed some more black to the previous shade to make a darker shade, made some patches with it once again and then smudging over it using a dry brush to smoothen it out. I created another darker layer in the same manner. After our base layer has dried up, I mixed some Prussian blue and dark green to make a very dark shade of green. And with that, one by one, I painted many leaves for our tree. I'm painting all the leaves one by one to make it look realistic. For our second shade, I mixed light and dark green to make a lighter shade. Majority of the lighter leaves should be at the part of the tree which is towards the clouds. And the farther end should be dark. I mixed some white to the previous shade to make a lighter shade and creating some more leaves with it towards the outer side of the trees. made some falling leaves with the same shade. Next for our raindrops, I took white paint and my brush size here is 0. I am making some slight movements in the downward direction with very light pressure on my hand. Do not put a lot of pressure, light pressure will end up giving you small smooth lines. As you can see, the brush is barely touching the surface. For the rooftop, I am using black. I 
I took the same grey which we had made for the base coat and using it on the higher sides of the rooftop and then blending the sides using a wet brush. I am painting some raindrops from the roof here for which I am using white paint on the borders of the raindrop and leave some grey space in between for the reflection. Similarly, add some more raindrops. Peel the masking tape off after your painting has become dry. Here you are with your aesthetic rain painting. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you did, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Also, if you recreate this, you can send it to me on my Instagram handle, link for which is given in the description. Thank you for watching.